Hey, you kids, get off my lawn. You don't want to make me come out there. Okay, guys. <laughs> here we are at the village. Now, I know we've been here once before. Oh, there's a chest over there I never saw. Okay, obviously we don't want those guys coming after us. Now, one thing I have uh, done is I have some regeneration potions on me. I've been doing a run around. Oh, great. You resisted that. So I made some hair. Uh, hero generations, yeah. I made some. Come on, mouse. There we go. I never noticed this dumb chest over here. How many times have I been up here? Well, twice. Oh, there's the bag. Well, I'll be darned. What else do I have to do here? Enchanted feathers. Okay. Silver. How many silver do in Erudy's bags? Erudy's bags, yeah. Okay, I do know that this can be a pain in the butt, because I watched... But what I'm going to try is, I don't know if it spawns in the same place or not. But is that invisibility? I sure hope so. And I'll tell you, I'm cheating. Yes, I'm cheating. I'm over here trying to run by these guys. And I don't know if it spawns in a different place all the time or not. But this is where uh, you couldn't have resisted that. There's no way. Oops, I forgot to take a health by regenerating push put health push. So yeah, I probably just cheated because this oh, I guess it was here. Okay. I watched it's me Gixie. And that's where she found it. And yes, that's cheating. I'm sorry. Or it's just good tactical sense to learn from your superiors. Right? Oh, you did. Okay. So I'm thinking, I'm going to say it's just good tactical sense to learn from your superiors. Ooh, an invincibility potion. So Gixie, thanks for figuring that out. Okay. Check out that cobra totem thing there, whatever that be. I may have to make some more invisibility potions if they work halfway decent. Now, I realized the last time we were there, we ran through a whole group of them. And we didn't do so well, but... It did get us that one side of the camp, you know. See, I need more silver. And I think there's more silver in the camp, I think. Let's see. Okay, okay. I think I know where I'm going. Probably not, but we're going to say I do.
but I had I was um, I'm trying to say here I did go ahead and level up to five so I could get these potions made I ran up and down the beach here and found uh, the stuff I needed so there we go now we're buffed up But I don't know what the next episode is going to be. Our next thing is. So we're going to go try that right now. Go back to the village. Go see Uncle Abernathy. Is that who needed the stuff? Was it Uncle Abernathy or was it this guy over here? Is that invisibility? Let's buy one. Actually, let's buy two. Okay, so it wasn't that one that needed it. Let's go over here. What is this? Oh, well, we need that. Nice. Now, I guess you can't click off the invisibility. Okay. You just got to wait till it wears off. Uncle, it's me. Oh, he didn't need this stuff. All right, who needed the stuff? Return Mata's lost bag to him in the village. Okay. Oh, he's over there. Mata must be the one over by that weapon thing or something then. This guy over here. Oh my, I haven't seen this in years. I wonder if these are still good. It appears so. I'll get to work. Come back anytime for more feathers. At a finder's discount, of course. And a curry feather imbued with the magical homing properties. Did I already have one of those? How much are they? Ten. I thought I had one of those. Yeah, okay. I wonder where you find boots at. Okay, well, we were. Well, I'm still invisible. That's amazing. I guess I'm not invisible anymore. Okay. Uh, totem, totem. I still wonder where I find boots at. No, no. Looks like I got all the spells I can learn from him. Okay, we want to go back to the docks. Right. Okay, they're both right in the center there. Okay. Was it you, Doc? Huh? You found one of my bags. That's great. Here's a few gold for your trouble, as I promised, and you can have your pick of one item from the bag. Let's take that one. Plus five gold. Okay, that's not the second guy. <laughs> Fine, I thought I found a bag. Is there more than one bag? It must be more than one bag, Dan, huh? Learn the cleanse recipe from the alchemy shop. Okay. Cleanse. Ooh, that's an expensive boy, too. Learn a cleanse. Shop the docks and use it to make one. Make, make one for somebody. Okay, cleanse. Cleanse. Oh, 
Oh wait, did I need to learn that first? Did I not? Did I not learn it? Oh, here we go. No, that's a dusty note. Huh. Spill book. Oh, wait a minute. Spill book. Spill book. Spill book. Huh. Didn't I learn cleanse? Did I do something dumb here? Cleanse recipe. Resets all potions. Requires silver and Crispin's glove. So maybe I just don't have enough of the Crispin's glove and silver to do that yet. Oh, there it is, right there. Right, right. I do have enough. Ooh, I don't now. Return to Abenaki with the cleanse potion. Okay, we shall do that. We'll go back and see Uncle Abernathy. We're going to use the teleporter. That is really nice. Oh, that's nice, convenient. It's a nice thought instead of having to run across huge amounts of space. You know what I mean? You brought the cleanse potion. Excellent work. Excellent work. Did you have any trouble with it? You were gone a long time. Overrun by the undead, but that means, listen to me, I will stay here and complete the ritual of tilting myself. After informing everybody of what's taken place, you should get to the lagoon as quickly as you can. Find the guard captain and tell him what you've seen. Find out what he knows. It may already be too late to warn him of the coming danger. Also, it's more important now than ever to remember that no one must know of your lineage. Your connection to your grandfather Mako puts you in danger. Go quickly, Curmudgeon. There is no time to waste. This can only be the work of the Skeleton King. Okay. Sounds like I'm screwed. Sounds like I'm a wanted man. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay, that looks like it's across this bridge. Hopefully that bridge is up now, because I don't think it was. I'm going to have to spend some time finding crispy snackers or whatever that stuff was. Who is this? Nobody. Well, it's somebody. It's just that they don't want to talk to me. I don't know which one's closer, the docks? All right. Can't remember where I found those Crispins at. That's from. We're going to take kind of take a little long jaunt here. I'm going to run through here and see if I can remember where I saw those crispy things at. I don't remember. Now yeah, that's not the one I'm looking for. Dang it! Where did I see those crispy things? Just drop the road there, guys. We're not too far off. Don't give up. Too bad you couldn't find silver as much as you can. This. Oh, excuse me, guys. Oof. Oof. I want that 3,000 gold headpiece. Actually, I want the boots. Does silver come back yet? Nope. Okay, so the bridge is repaired. Isn't magic wonderful? Now, obviously, or not obviously, I have not been here before, so I'm not sure what I'm heading into. This could be deadly. 
I don't seem to be getting any experience. So I hope that's not a bug. be cool if they had like little squirrels and bunny rabbits and stuff like that running around. Firewort. Oh, that sounds promising. Strange folks, these seekers. I remember hearing tales of them when I was young. They sure saved our butts today, though. Well, that's because we are pretty cool that way. Abernathy sent you. Well, I'm glad you're here. I got his message, but couldn't spare anyone to take the message back to him. We've been under attack for hours. Wave after wave of undead. It's only just let up a few minutes ago. At first, the water spirits were attacking the undead, and it was going well. Then something started corrupting the spirits. One by one, they began turning on us. To be honest, I'm not sure we could have held up much longer if the Seekers hadn't shown up. I know Abernathy will want to hear the news as soon as possible, but I really need your help before you go. I need you to figure out how to free the water spirits from the corruption that, that's taken hold of them. Most of guards have little or no shaman training, but you could ask around and see if anyone else has any ideas. Okay, well... Maybe we should just start asking right here. Hey, come here. It's good to have a shaman here, finally. I hear you're trying to undo the corruption that took hold of the Guardian Spirits. The Seekers almost certainly could do it, but they're not from around here, and they follow some harebrained rules of engagement when visiting our world. They won't even really talk to us. Okay. All right. The Seekers don't usually get involved unless they're directly attacked or threatened. If you ask me, though, it's no coincidence that they set up camp here in the lagoon between us and this mob of invading undead. Someone's watching out for us. Okay. Sounds like probably a plan, right, you know? Any more firewort? Oh, there's Tanzanica though. Have you been over to the Seekers camp? They won't really speak to us or interact with us. I've heard some of them speaking with shamans before. Maybe they'll talk to you. Okay, so those are probably the corrupted spirits, I'm going to guess. Oop, my HUD is you know, level 7. Holy mackerel! Level 7. That might hurt. Okay. Okay, the bees are the bees. The bees like us. A giant bee level six. Well, I guess we might as well find out and go over here and see if the bees like us or not, right? Okay, that's good to pick up. That should be good to pick up, but I can't. Mug? Oh, I guess that's trees. Oh, guess what? Guess what? Guess what found me? Ouch! That hurt. So obviously I got too close to him. It was this guy. You should speak with the expedition master right away. Okay, I'd be glad to do that if I knew where he was at. Ah, dang it. Can't get him targeted. 
Uh oh, that one didn't work. Didn't get it away. Oh, look at that big dude over there. Now you know that that's not going to work good. I guess there wasn't anything to click. Okay. Expedition Master. So straight ahead and to my left. Now if you birds don't leave me alone, I'm going to have to hurt you. I just want you to know that if you don't leave me alone, I'm going to have to hurt you. Now is that thing making noise because it's coming after me? No. We might as well go collect all this stuff, right guys? Uh oh! Guess what? They don't like me. Oh shit, they killed me. Okay, well now we know the bees don't like me. Which is kind of unusual. You think that shamans and bees would get along, you know, being a nature type thing and all of that, don't you think? Oh crap. Okay, now why is, oh I bet I, aha, uh -huh. I bet it had something to do with picking that flower, guys. What do you want to bet? You see, look, look, look. They don't care. Uh oh, now that didn't work because it looks like he's, is he coming after me? See, so just go and look at the flower. And he's saying, all right, somebody took our flower. And I'm not really excited about that. We're probably going to have to find out who it was and hurt them. I mean, I don't speak B, but I'm just I'm just paraphrasing here. Is that the term I want to use, paraphrasing? Yeah, paraphrasing. Okay, now... Okay, let's test it. Let's see if this guy attacks us. Nope. Okay, so lesson learned, don't pick don't pick flowers in front of the bees. They are not happy about that. Now, where did I need to go? Okay, okay. Now wait a minute, what's this big ass guy over here for? Level 20? All right, to hell with it. Maybe he's on our side. I guess we're going to find out real quick. He does look kind of cool, though, don't he? Hi, I'm Curmudgeon. Oh, okay. You should speak with the expedition. Okay, I thought you were the expedition master. Nope, he's a stone guardian. Okay. Map, map, map. Okay. I thought I was at the Expedition Master. Okay, I can't get in there. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Okay. I guess I'm in the wrong spot. Maybe this isn't the lagoon. I have this terrible feeling I'm getting into a zone that's way beyond my level. 
Do you guys get the same feeling? Hmm. Figure out how to undo the corruption that's taken a hold of. I don't know. Okay, that's an undead thing. I see a skeleton up there, and I am not even going up there. I may be brave, but I ain't that damn brave. Level three. Okay, they're just still the same level as the other place. And they don't attack me. That's good. Turtles are still level three. Okay, that's good. Now, if you turtles leave me alone, I won't be making soup out of you. But if you come mess with me, I'm going to make soup out of you. Just so you know. Sorry, the boat's not available. Okay, so this is obviously going to be a different zone. Okay. So I guess I'm not ready to quest here yet. Damn, guys, we're up to 26 minutes. 26 minutes. And what have I accomplished? Well, I guess I'm okay, yeah. Alright, well, we aren't going up to that undead castle. No, 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 no. We're not doing that. Yeah, of course it'd be too far away. Okay, so I'm going to say we don't get anything from them but water. And I probably shouldn't have wasted that mana because I don't have a totem close by, but I just kind of wanted to see. Let's see, do I have any cheap mana potions on me? Nope, that's focus. That's invincibility. Okay, well, I'm going to have to go. I can't, uh, honestly can't figure out where the expedition leader is, unless that's him over there. And I hate wasting that potion, but you know what? If we're going to have to do talk or deal with these guys, we probably ought to... Oh, crap, it was resisted. I just wanted to experience, guys. I was being an experienced pig. Or a hog. Is that what they call them? Hogs. Okay, now this don't look good. They're not going to let me in here, are they? Oh, they did. Sweet, you guys are okay. I like you now. Greetings, grandson of Mako. Yes, I know who you are. I knew your grandfather well. He was a dear friend. I am sure you have many questions. I can give you few answers. First, I will help you with the guardian spirits which have corrupted by the skeletons, have been corrupted by the skeleton king's dark voodoo. We prepared a collection of pl collection platform for you just outside the camp. It has been a power, it has a powerful enchantment on it designed to purify the corruption that has taken hold of the water spirits. Lure the water spirits into the, onto the platform and defeat them there. Doing so will cause them to cause them to destabilize and temporarily lose form. Basically, they should turn into a puddle. Read the incantation on the scroll next to the platform to activate the enchantment and purify them. After a moment, they should reform. But beware, the collection platform will purify a single spirit at a time and no more. If you attempt to purify more than one at a time, the results will be dangerous, unpredictable, and potentially dangerous. 
Return me when you respeed, return, restore the peace to the lagoon. Okay, cool. What do we got here? Mako's Rage and an Overwatch Stone. Okay. Let's see what Mako's Rage Overwatch Stone. A gift from your grandfather. Overwatch Stone. Artifact. Hmm. I wonder if I can get more more things up there because I don't I only have one spot. And I got a couple stones. Hmm. Okay. Uh, let's go talk to this guy. Oh, what does he teach? Ice Comet. How much is it? 2500 Holy crap! I'm going to get a part-time job. You have the basics available for purchase. Purchase. Care to help me out with something more interesting I'm working on? Oh, yeah, why not? Oh, excellent. I've been working on some time dilation. I know, I know. The old news, right? Ah, uh, but I want to put it in the convenience of a bottle. I need one last ingredient to complete my work. It's a brilliant red flower that's extremely rare, and as luck would have it, this lagoon is one of the few places it grows. Unfortunately, the bees love it too, though. If you can bring me six of these flowers, I'll share some of the end product with you. Okay, so I, ha I have an idea what that's all about, because I already got attacked by the bees. Okay, there's nothing there I can do. Okay. Alright guys, we are going to stop right here and come back in the next episode and try to beat the water spirits. But, oh, look, wait a minute, there's something here to loot. I don't know if I've used this for anything yet. We're going to take it. Okay. I'm going to go back inside the blue dome. I wonder how they want me to lure them over here. Maybe with a fireball? That might work. Alright guys, talk to you in the next episode. Thanks for watching that as always. Please like, subscribe, and share. And if you get a chance, check out Arnett Anarchy. Okay, check out Tanzia on the Steam forums. Bye bye guys.